welcome to my video. I thought I'd update you on my goldfish tank. The water is not very clear because I had treated this tank with methylene blue. I just got some merino balls in here. I already had two but I got them some more because they just love playing with them. This one's pretty blind so I gotta show them where the food is. There you go. Yum yum yum. So he's quite well trained. If I show him where the food is with my finger, he will swim there. And my, my lemon head has no trouble finding food. But yeah, so this guy is fast, but he's blind. And this guy can see perfectly well. But he's a little bit slower than him. But he is actually the one that gets the food first. So there's no competition, really. So... Yeah, and they're just having a good time. I was treating for this guy, he's got a few little spots on his tail, but I treated for two weeks and they're still there, so I think that it's maybe just stress ick, not regular ick. I'm hoping that's all it is. So, yeah, I think they've grown quite a bit since I got them, especially this one's grown in length. But yeah, they really like swimming around and playing with all... There's a little bit of sand in here, and they like to sort through it, but there's only a little bit. It's just aragonite sand, because it helps keep the KH up in the water. And I think they're both doing well. I only have a little light, because these don't need much light. And I've noticed that the lighter the tank is, the better the black more can see. So towards the evening, like right now, like he can't see. Hey, hello. So yeah, I really enjoy these guys, and I'm going to have to get a bigger tank. This one, I'll just stand back, is about 110, but there's about 120 litres, including... Because I have a little down here, you'll see. Oh, it's too dark. I have a canister filter going. And what I have in here is I just have some bubbles and I have a small aquarium heater and I'm keeping it at 21 degrees, which is still cold, but Oranas don't like super cold water. He came from a very cold situation in a pond where it was almost probably about down to zero degrees possibly. So I'm not surprised. This you can see it right there. Stressic. That's what I think it is. That's what I hope it is. I don't want it to be something that is gonna be a big deal to move fish. But yeah, they're all happy, they eat, they play. They're very loving towards each other, like they're always brushing each other, like curling around, but I think they're both males, so I'm not expecting eggs, but if you can identify whether they're male or female. They said 90% that the Oranda was a male, but on close inspection I see two little fins underneath the tail, so I don't really know. So if you can identify, please comment down below. I'm pretty sure the black is male. So take a good look. I don't know if that's... If you're an expert at sex and goldfish, please tell me. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. Sorry about the murky water, but it is because of medication. And I'm flushing it out slowly it's just so cute so have a look have a look see he's missing a his scales are growing back from since I've treated them they're so cute you're so cute okay let's give Maya a little bit of attention because she's cute too yeah thanks for watching bye guys